watcher and subscribers today's tutorial is very very important for you because here we are going to see validation in excel so that when you provide this your sheet to any user that user will not do any mistake okay whether it is knowingly or unknowingly but that user will fill up the data accurately only so that is what the data validation data validation means avoid mistakes while entering the data for example here name are already present so here the gender is there so what happen in this uh, gender category i want in this sheet the uh, user should enter either male or female because if i provide this uh, excel sheet to any user and if i don't do the data validation then what happen here the user will enter male female or maybe uh, by mistake uh, user will type the name or whatever it is so for avoiding this mistake we have to use data validation for example here age is there so age should come in the number okay uh, there should be uh, what we can say there should be no text okay so for uh, avoiding uh, such restriction in the data we have to use data validation data validation means uh, we force to user to enter the correct data format so that uh, the data will be correctly managed so for doing this we have to use data validation now without wasting time we start the data validation practically so this is what the gender i want the user should enter only male or female so i will just select this list of sales and then in the data option i have to click on data validation once i click here you will get this dialog box and you have to select setting option in that setting option i have to select list option why list because i want to provide option to user that is male and female so i will select list option and here in the source i have to click on here and then i should provide the list of items so just i am selecting this two value by my mouse pointer once i select this this address will generate here automatically so i have to just press enter key from the keyboard and just hit on the okay now you observe here in this list here uh, you if you just click here you are getting this two atom male and female so i can easily enter this here also i can select either male or female so i can just hit on male so in this way you can do the data validation so along with that you can also provide the addition option there suppose here uh, suppose if i type uh, yes you are age by mistake i am typing my name so what what happen once i click on enter you are uh, getting the error message okay but suppose uh, you want to add there uh, along with that you want to add some additional thing means here i have already done the data validation but along with that i want to put uh, some kind of error if the user enter the wrong information as well as i want to give some guideline to the user while providing the while entering the data so again i will click on data validation and now you understood about this setting option i will go in the input here i will type in the title enter so here i type enter gender only that is male or female so once i do on okay then you observe here what will happen whenever i will click here you will get this uh, box and here it will give you uh, it will give guideline to the user that is enter gen only male or female so it will look good in the if you provide this sheet to the any user so that user will immediately get the idea about the entering correct information again i am going into the data validation option and here there is a error so here we have the option like warning stop information if you want to do data validation strictly then you select the stop option and here you give the title enter then here enter male or female 
so here my title is enter correct value enter male or female then just I click on ok so now when I click here and if I type any other values that is not male or female and just I click enter you see now the custom dialog box is coming that is enter correct value enter male or female and cancel that value is removed you can also go for warning message but the this top option is uh, proper for the data validation now you understood how you can add the list of values and apply the data validation now we will go for the age here I want the user should enter the values uh, in the number okay so for that I am again going into the data validation tab and here uh, in the setting option I have to select the whole number then it is asking two option minimum and maximum I want the age should be uh, minimum 10 and maximum 100 and then click on ok so what happened when I enter the 10 it is accepting 100 accepting if I do with 44 accepting if I go with 111 it is showing the error message so in this way the data validation works so here in the data validation you learn how you can go for the gender information with the data validation how you can go for the numerical value like age for the data validation so I hope uh, dear student you understood the concept of data validation and it help us to guide the user for entering the correct information in the sheet so thanks for watching this tutorial thank you